All right, guys, back for round two. My iPad ran out of storage, so here we are finishing up the unboxing video. So this is now gonna be two separate videos. Eh, it is what it is. Okay, are you ready? So what I had just started to say in the other video is that I can't keep dog books on the shelf. I was really looking for cat books, but I couldn't find a good series of cat books. But I've got some nice, I'm pretty sure these are early reader nonfiction books about dogs. So this one is all about Great Danes, all about Siberian Huskies, aren't they cute? All about Dalmatians, uh, all about Golden Retrievers, and all about poodles. So those are fantastic. I know those are gonna be a huge hit. Okay, also, oh, so exciting. This is only part of them. Okay, this one, I haven't read it, but I can't wait to read it. Look at all the awards this book has run. You, do you see all those medals on it? This book is called Watercress. I'm pretty sure it was a Caldecott, yes. This was a Caldecott medal book, which means it won an award for its pictures. Okay, it's also a Newbery Honor book, kind of like, um, oh, the, the Tiger book I showed you earlier. So this one's won lots of awards, and it's got a third one I've never even heard of that says picture book winner for, oh, for Asian and Pacific Americans. So this book has to do with that culture of Asian and Pacific Americans called Watercress. Oh, it does have beautiful pictures, look. Looks like a painting, doesn't it? Okay, I cannot wait to read this book and it will be on the shelves soon. So there's that one. This one is another award winner. I don't see the medal on here. I feel like this one is another Caldecott. If not, it's because it really represents um, an indigenous group of people, like a Native American group of people. It's called we are water protectors. I'll have to read it to tell you more about it, but also look at those beautiful, beautiful illustrations. Kind of looks like, look at it. It's kind of reminding me of Moana right now. Do you see the older woman? And it looks like they're telling some kind of story and maybe having some kind of a, um, like a ritual or look at these beautiful pictures. Yes, can't wait to read that one. Okay. Guys, we have the bad seed in the library, but we do not have some of the other books. So we've gotten two of the other books that go with the bad seed. So now we have in the library, the couch potato, and we also have the cool bean, but there are more of these that are coming. The good egg should be coming. And I think there's one called the smart cookie should also be coming. Not yet, but these will be the first two that make it in our library from author Jory John, so that's exciting. Last one in the book box this week is a biography of Aaron Rodgers. So I was trying to pick out a few um, sports people that might be of interest. Like I said, I was trying to bulk up our um, football section and make it more current because some of that stuff's old. Some of those players that we have in the library don't even play football anymore. So that is it for our unboxing video. I hope you're excited about some of these new books. I am so excited and I'm gonna to try to get them on the shelf by next week. We'll see, it does take me a while to do it. So thanks for watching.